God doesn't answer prayer. One, ask and you shall receive. You do not visualize prayer. You ask God out loud. You don't visualize a prayer. You say a prayer. You do not stare into a crystal that's idolatry. As powerful as God is, he's not going to answer you until you ask him in the authority of Jesus' name. Secondly, ask in faith believing. Mark 11, 22, For verily I say unto you, Whosoever shall not doubt in his heart, but shall, but shall believe that those things which he says shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he saith, not thinketh, saith, say it with me, saith. God Almighty gave you the ability to speak so you could pray. Not so you could have a telephone ministry, but pray. God is not a statue of stone or wood. He speaks, he talks, he thinks, he feels your infirmities. He answers our prayer. He's alive. He is in this place. Jehovah Shalom, the Lord our peace. He is in this place. The victory is ours through Christ the Lord. He created this magnificent world from nothing. That's a miracle. Bible says that God said and it happened and God said and it happened and God said and it happened and God created man in the image of God and man said and then God created Eve and she said that God gets excited when you get done on your knees. Look angels, here they come. Let's see what they're going to ask for. Get ready to go to earth and answer this and then you get down and ask him to walk the ground. When you pray, ask big. Say that again. Ask big. Ask according to his infinite power. When you ask God for something, ask for more than you need. Get it all. John 14, 14, if you ask anything in my name, I will do it.